Uh, some MPs <laughs> are calling for a tighter regulation of electric bikes and e-scooters by introducing number plates for pedestrian safety, and that follows a number of high-profile accidents. Should we go even further and make registration plates mandatory for all cyclists on the road? We're joined now by Howard Cox, founder of Fair Fuel UK oh. Campaign, who says the roads are like the Wild West <laughs> with cyclists, alongside broadcaster and cycling enthusiast Timmy Mallet, who says it's... Just another way for motorists to point the blame. Howard Cox, why would putting registration plates on bikes help? Well, it, it, it's simple, really. What we're seeing at the moment, you mentioned it's a wild west out there. You ask any... No, you mentioned that. Well, that's true. If you talk to any HGV driver, uh, a white van man, a, a, a taxi cab, our cabbies in London, and don't forget this, we're talking about all urban areas, and that's where I, is the problem. Mm. Cyclists, unfortunately, are running riots all over the place, going through red lights, cycling on pavements all over the place, and if they are caught or doing something like that, well, they're never caught, you can't recognise uh, and, and right. chase them up to try and give them some punishment. Mm, Timmy Mallet. Put a registration on your bike and you do something naughty, we can find out where you are. Now, this is interesting because uh, I've, when I heard this story, I instantly went back to April the 1st, 1985. Right. And on Wackaday that morning, <laughs> we ran a lovely little April Fool's gag saying that you had to have a licence for your bicycle and that you could get one before midday if you went down to your local police station and you'd get a, a licence for your bike. Well, of course... <laughs> <laughs> hundreds of wide awakers went off to their local police station and were told it's an April Fool's gag. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm finding myself thinking this is another one of those gags. Surely it well, comes on. round there's, and there's round nothing, in There's nothing circles. funny about this to me. If I'm, and, and I'm speaking from experience here. If I'm sitting at the traffic lights and they're on red, and, and this happens a lot, and a cyclist nips through and, 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 and breaks, breaks the red light, I'm thinking, well, if I did that, I'd get three points on my licence and a £1,500 fine. How come he's allowed to do it just because he's on a different form of mm. transportation? Well, of course, it, we're not allowed to do things like that. No, but they do do it. And you, and you can't The point is we're, uh, that when you're on the roads, we are sharing a space. No, you're not answering the question, Timmy. Sorry, don't, don't be the politician. A, 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 cy <laughs> a cyclist goes through a, re a red light... I'm not a politician, a Richard. I'm a, a man light, with a mallet and, and a man the, with a and bicycle. And he breaks the law. So, no, if he doesn't have a registration a plate on the back of his bike, he can't... Can't, yeah. uh, he's photographed, he can't be contacted, he can't be prosecuted. What's wrong with having a licence plate on the back of your bike? Because you can't police having licence plates on the back of people's bikes. Why not? We want to encourage people to be on their mm. bicycles. This weekend, in the lovely weather, Richard, thousands of people out on their bicycles as families enjoying the fresh air, mm. fun, health, and good why exercise. Can't you police a now, this why, is why a really a good thing to do. Why can't you police a registration plate on the back of a bike in the same way as you would on a, on a car or a van? Or well, a let me put it to you like this, Richard. <laughs> Your bicycle at home, which mm -hmm. has probably not been ridden for a little while... No, I ride it all the time. You do? Yeah, I do, yeah. Splendid. How often do you ride? Uh, about every three days. Good man. Yeah. I like you. You and I are going for a bike ride later. <laughs> okay. But I wouldn't mind having a licence plate on the back. You really? No. OK, okay so, so how do you deal with... Tim, uh, uh, Howard, Timmy says that it couldn't be policed by police. Um, I want to ask, though, about electric bikes, because I mm. think that that has changed the game. It's one thing if you're on a pavement and a cyclist is riding on the pavement, maybe because it's a very dangerous road they feel a bit unsafe. But when it's an electric bike... Mm. It's far more dangerous. Do you think that has changed the rules? Well, I think all road users should pay for the use of the roads. It's as simple as that. Maybe it should be a minimal price for all these cyclists, but powered bikes, and that's what they are, they were, I don't if you remember the old mopeds, you could actually pedal the old mopeds. Yes, those I had sort, one. Do you remember? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We both did, yeah, then, yeah. Richard. And those <laughs> are the sorts of things, and that's what electric bikes have come. Mm. And when you go through a 20 mile an hour zone, which are being everywhere around uh, London at the moment in time, and you get overtaken not only by electric bikes, but also people like Timmy Mallet can do 30, 35 mile an hour on their wonderful super, you know, psychedelic bikes. Um, the, it, it's an issue. And what we need to do is get some common sense. And I believe it's not necessarily a registration plate, but maybe a Tabard. I think it's the you should be the, the cyclists should be registered insured. I think they should be MOT, the yeah. similar to the other things that are roadworthy okay. because you don't contribute anything right. financially to the road. Sorry, right. Timmy, that's yes, where we must leave it because we've got to tell you both to get on your bike. We asked you whether you think cyclists <laughs> should have registration plates, and 72% wow. disagreed with you, Timmy. They want the registration. Nearly three Richard, you and I are going to go for a bike ride and <laughs> oh, we're going to oh, take a pedal. You. you and I yeah, will go and cycle. Watch out for along Howard. Good morning, Britain. Back tomorrow from six. Now it's time to join the ring.